Ah, oh, hey. Take some soup. Uh, I don't have a bottle though. Sorry. Are we okay? Yeah, we 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 recovered. That's cool. Oh shit! Whoa! Holy heck! Ah, uh, my little buddies and the posters. The world can be saved. Find her. Holy shit! This is kind of this is fucked up, dude. Actually, status effects scared. Cool. Ah, uh, okay. Scared stops you in your tracks. Wary slightly increased defense. Weird reduces defense and attack. Stun knocks you on temporarily. Okay, these are the status effects, I guess. Cry obscures your vision. Rage critical hit rate. Piss makes you go berserk. Drunk strong but slower and dumb. Hangover reduces everything. Stink makes people avoid you. Cool regenerates HP. Depression makes your <laughs> makes life suck. Oiled up makes you flammable. Withdrawal hurts you all over. Joyed makes it all better. Huh. All right. Uh huh. I see. Skills? Oh no, wait. I'm gonna keep forgetting. Verbal bash. Execute. Ah, damn it. Ha, you failed, boy. Get him. Okay. Um, hint. A little cheer. Yeah, give a little Brad a little cheer here. Alright. We're cool. Should I be using... Should I just keep using Buster Punches? Is that okay? I don't know. Um, hint. Throwable Bash. Execute. Pissed. Ah, uh, that's... That's not good, is it? Ah, damn it. What happened? Oh, okay. Oh, I thought my game hung up there for a second. Jeez. Okay. Oh, I leveled up. Here's to zoom up. Inform. Okay. Diet Cola Cola. Cool. And he's gone. So we got some new stuff. Um, let's see. Alright, what skills do we got for you? Terry? No. Um, no, oh, hints. Uh-huh. Tell your friends some of the favorite combat tips. Increases SP. Ah, okay. That's, so it's, uh, helps recovering. What the fuck is... You know what? This is fine. Hey, he's full of holes. Oh, oh no! He, I guess that was Brad describing the guy. Huh? Oh, there's a chicken up there. Hey, uh, sup? Leave. Take your pervert war elsewhere. I want no part in this. Okay. <laughs> he just points out, like, get out of here. Can I talk to the chickens? No? Okay. Uh, huh. Ow! Okay, that's not good. Ow. Am I still okay? Yeah, that's. I, sh I shouldn't do that. How are you doing? He's dead. Uh. Oh, there's bottles. God damn it. I should stop that. Cedar Red Skulls. It means Randall's army has taken over. Which sucks. Because the only gasoline with the miles is in there. How the hell am I gonna make fire bombs? Hmm. What the fuck are you? Um. What? Hey, pal. You okay? He got an arrow stuck on his back. He does not look okay in any way. What's wrong? Getting sentimental, brother? Uh, nope. Just asking. Uh oh. Here it comes. It's closing my eye. I'm closing my eyes. Good night, Aloth. Uh, bye. <laughs> Lucas gave his final breath. Okay. Hey, um, not sure what that was about. Anyway, a whole mob of guys ran through here going about a girl. 
A balding guy in pink and phallic headed man in green cut the bridge out. They look really scared. Neither of them fit for battle. Everyone got pissed and started to leave. And all then all of a sudden these three dudes with amazing hair found a girl. Apparently she was in that truck. Pretty crazy, huh? They invited everyone back to their clubhouse in the old factory. I didn't go. That chick looked ugly. Who the fuck are you calling ugly? It's my it's my buddy. Oh shit, wrong button. Alright, I should be careful as what what I press. So she's in here? No? Okay, so I, I'm guessing we're gonna have to cr find a way to cross that bridge. Excuse me. Can I- Do you have more dialogue? Oh, no. Okay. Same- Same banana. I got it. I got it. I got it. What? Okay. Huh. Kinda want that bottle. Maybe later. Let's check the big door. Oh, what the hell? Um. Uh, yeah, no. Let's not. What happened? Did I get damaged? What's in here? Alright, there we go. At least this one has some light. Um. Hmm? Oh, wait, I can go up there. No, wait, I can't. There's a hole. What about here? Nope. Huh. How'd I get down there? Can I get down there? Oh, I can. Ow. Found a secret stash. Ten magazines. So... People are going on about this... There's no women left in this world? I think, I think that's what the premise of the game is, right? So everyone's going... Oh, shit. What can be saved? Find her. Jesus. So the world is just overrun by per men and per perverted men, aren't they? Isn't it? What's up here? Where the hell am I going now? I have honestly... Oh, hey. I know this guy. Um... Yeah. You know, I'll listen to your story. Sure. I know this guy from Video Game Donkey. Hmm. I think he'll explain the lore. Oh, hello there. My name is Nern. I'm considered the greatest historian of our time. I've gathered a wealth of knowledge about Olaf and what happened. Many tales. Would you like to hear? Yeah. Hmm. I wish you were enthusiastic. Oh well. I'll tell you anyway. What? <laughs> I did. I said yes. Let's see. All right. It was all start with I like to call the Flash. I was sitting with my wife, God rest her soul, sipping on sweet lemon tea. I believe it was homemade by my sweet wife, God rest her soul. Oh wait, maybe she maybe she bought it from the store in a bottle. You know, like a plastic bottle. Well, hold on now. That would be ridiculous to buy a bottle of sweet lemon tea, then transfer the contents into a glass. Why not just drink it for the bottle? I guess maybe so she could put ice in a glass. But then again, making tea homemade would be just as time consuming, if not more. What the fuck are you talking about? <laughs> that sneaky bitch. Anyway, I'll save you that story for later. Please don't. So I'm sitting on my porch drinking sweet lemon tea, from a glass of course. <laughs> When suddenly, a great strangeness fills my body. Something was wrong. I lived many years and I've never felt something like this before. Do you know what it was? Yep, it was my rocking chair. The wooden son of the gun stopped rocking. So I looked down and realized a little rock had gotten caught beneath the chair. Some of the text is kind of cropped off. I rock under my rocking chair. What a day. I decided it was the time for bed. I had a little bit too much excitement for one day. <laughs> I slid into my jammies, brushed my teeth, and said my prayers. As I was climbing into bed, I noticed my wife, God rest her soul, brushing her hair in the bathroom. As I peered across the hall, my body swelled up with emotion. Why can't I be married to an attractive woman? Is it me? My bank account? <laughs> I'm a tall guy. I work out 40 minutes a week. 40 minutes a week? Is that enough? No. Now, my neighbor at the time, For Tom Forknight, was very short. His wife, Karen Forknight Plateburger, <laughs> yeah, one of those women. Well, she was more attractive than my wife. I'd say she was soft six, whereas my father was a hard four. What's the deal? I thought women liked tall men. Why was Karen with them? Anyway, my horse of a wife, God rest her soul, crawled into bed next to me. 
she decided to leave the bedside light so she could read her book. It was one of her romance novels again. Give me a break. As if I don't already feel inadequate enough. Not only do I have to compete with Tom, now I have to deal with these fictional hunks. Ay ay ay. At this point, I have already suppressed the urges of intimacy. I rolled over and tried to sleep. Her bedside light was only a minor annoyance. I was able to drift off. Then I woke up to a big flash of light. That's about it. Huh. I think you should tell more. Jeez, you're kind of smothering me. I'll talk to you later. Okay. I can tell by the way you're walking away that you don't want to leave. If you really want to hear another story, I'll tell you. Yeah, sure. Keep going. Once upon a hunt summer night, sometime in July. Was it July? My local grocery store sells really good eggs in July. I don't know why. Do chickens operate better in heat? Fireworks, maybe? I don't know. I don't want to get off topic. Point is, the eggs that summer were marvelous. Anyway, my wife and I, God rest her soul, went to a barbecue that night. It was held at Dale's Spooner house. Well, his backyard. Connie Spooner doesn't want people in her home. I think she's just an uptight bitch. So at this barbecue, I see none other than, that's right, Tom Fortnite. Now, earlier in my day, my wife, God rest her soul, had made potato salad for the barbecue. Personally, I hate potato salad. I'm a mashed kind of fellow. <laughs> so I sat in the TV room, avoiding her... Uh... What? Ah, uh, whatever. Avoiding her till the bar till the barbecue. There we go. Once we were at the party, I made sure to distance myself from my dumb potato bitch wife. <laughs> God rest her soul. I just didn't want anyone to think I would associate with someone that would bring a potato salad. Anyway, Tom and his above mediocre wife were already there. Damn. And get this. They brought a fruit salad with whipped cream. The nerve of those fork nights. Needless to say, I gave my wife, God rest her soul, a couple choice words about whipped cream. First is potato salad. Son of a bitch. A real tongue lashing. Is that it? Okay. Okay. Um, alright, let's 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 check out this house. Is there anything in here? Can I get something in here? Oh, what the hell? I didn't know I could do that. Sweet. Okay. Anything back here? No? No. Okay. It was a long story. I don't know. I like listening to people's stories, actually. And, of course, it's not over. <laughs> well, hello again. Funny seeing you here. Same. What are you following me? What are you following me or something? <laughs> anyway. I often wonder what all happened here. What was that big flash? Why are we here? Even our night and day circle is odd. Cycle. Sometimes days last ages and nights come rarely. And these clouds, so strange. Are they? What's happened to our Earth? Hmm. Oh well. Enough of that boring stuff. I once had a real. <laughs> I was really had a cocky day at the doctor's office. Okay. I was in the waiting room reading a teen magazine. Normally I don't indulge in adults in publications, but I couldn't resist. I had recently heard the new artist on the radio, Ulysses Utensils. She's some young woman. Maybe a boy. I don't know. Either way, that child can really grasp my attention. So I'm reading this magazine because I saw Ulysses on the cover. I still wasn't able to identify if it was a man or a woman. Am I still recording? Yeah, I'm still recording. Sorry about that. But as I'm reading, I noticed something on the ceiling. I look up to see that there's some water damage. You think a doctor would make enough money to maintain this office? <sighs> Sorry, I had to burp. Guess he cares about his cool jet skis more than his patient's comfort. His assumedly big house and hard-bodied hard wife. High-bodied? Wish my wife was like that. Huh. It's okay, buddy. Boo. Melons. <laughs> okay. There we go. Uh, that, that's why. You have more dialogue? Just then, a droplet of water falls from the ceiling. My eyes trail all the way to the ground. I stare at the floor for some time, watching the carpet absorb the water. Really? Suddenly, my attention is caught by a small child. The child was glaring directly at me. I saw the devil looking right back at me beneath his eyes. I got nervous and quickly stared directly at my feet as to not aggravate the child. That's when I noticed something. I was wearing two different kinds of socks! <laughs> Golly, I'm all revved up after these thrilling exchanges. Sure, exchanges. That's what we want to call it. To be fair, you're a bit of a boy, but beggars can't be choosers. I think I'll stick around. I got many a tale to tell.
All right, you got a new party member. This should be fun. Did I check on this guy? I don't think so. Smooth. Ah, Jesse. Annoying guy. Um, I don't know. I wouldn't call him annoying. He's he's pretty okay to me. Can I not? Oh yeah, wait. There's those boxes down there. I could use those. Okay, going up here. Can I go? Can I? I can. Ah shit. Can I, can I not go up there? Okay, I guess not. What's back here? Bar? Is it a hint? Bars! You can often find people for hire in bars. If you see a pink poster, you can access your party formation. For when you want to swap party members in and out. Bars are great places. Chug a lug and Terry. Huh. Okay. Hey, uh, what's up? Yo! What's happening, my man? You got a couple of mags for me? I roll with your pack, brother. Energetic ex-pro wrestler known for his devastating headbutts. A rage always puts the battle first, and his health second. He has high speed and attack, but somewhat low defense. Hmm. Let's walk away for now. I'll be waiting, my man. Watch here. Oh. Oh, what's this? Oh, okay. Uh. Oh, okay. I'm guessing that we can change at any time. I have a little interest in scandalous magazines. I'm just looking for a stiff drink and good memories. That's all this was to offer anyway. Buy him a drink, 20 mags. I mean, sure. You have enough. Ah, shit. Okay. Walk away. What the fuck is with the sound? What's going on? Alright. Wait, I don't have enough mags though, right? How many? I don't have any. Yeah. Oh well. Guess we'll check on this later then. Let's go this way. God, her face is everywhere. Okay, we gotta find our, uh, our little buddy. What the hell? What's this? Weird. Hey, um. Buzz off! Don't oh, mind, Eagle. He's a bit of a prick. Well, there's nothing on the table. Huh. Well, what the hell? Are we getting. Do we get hungry or something? Because I'm seeing... There's a flash of red there. Hello, chum. Want to invest in my wonderful product? It's really worth your time. I don't have any mags. You obviously don't know business. Ah, oh, God. Okay. Hey, uh, you look like a diglet. Honestly, I'm happier now that the world has ended. It helps my wife and kids aren't here. Okay. Take some soup. I don't have any bottles. Wait, can I? Let's see what happens. You don't have any empty bottles. Oh, of course. What's up here? Ah, shit. There's nothing up here. What the hell? What are the point of these things? Um, hey, shop. Try buying something from me, I dare ya. Okay, there we go. Hmm. Why is this forever wet? That's really gross. Uh. Okay, I can only afford this and this. Oh, this is for Terry. Can I sell something? I can only have diet cola. Alright. Well, there goes my mags. Um, equipment. Terry. Drab tank top. Yeah. There we go. Can I sell you something? You don't need this anymore. 
Alright. Pleasure doing business with you. Business with you. How do I go down there? I wanna go down there. Okay. Up here? I don't think we- I don't reckon we talk to this guy. People think this girl is some kind of godsend. That ain't so. It's gonna tear us all apart. I just wanna find my little buddy, dude. Hey. Listen here, brother. I got a stack of magazines with your name on it. I just need you to give me a refreshing bottle of liquid. I'll do it myself, but I'm all washed up. Oh. Okay. Sure. Um... Bar? Maybe, um... Huh. Perhaps I can? What does the soup do? I don't remember what the soup does. Items... Follow soup. Okay, pretty straightforward. It recovers HP. Going down! This is save point back here. I'll save here. I feel like there's something else I'm supposed to do. Um. Hey, how you doing? There's an abandoned building just down the way here. My friends and I are playing some cards in there. I just stepped out for some air, but she should join us. Okay. Down here? There's a drawer up there. I wonder what that does. This is- this looks like a trap. Well, hi! Oh, it's a merchant. Cool. Oh! Cool! Ah, oh, I don't have any mags though. Shit. How much do these sell for? Only one magazine? Damn it. Okay. That's pretty cool though. Uh-huh. Oh, there it is. Can I, can I not, um, okay. You would think that he'll be able to push that, but nope. I got the joy, joy, joy. Joy down in my heart. Joy down in my heart. Down in my heart. I got the joy, 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 joy down in my heart. Down in my heart today. Don't know that song. Joy down in my heart. Oh. How about you? Oh, um, um, uh, okay. Oh, it's you. Your heart seems unhappy. Uh, this is fucking Mub Psycho 100 all over again. Let's cheer it up. No! Oh. Remember to take care of yourself. I'll check up on you soon. Yeah. Can I, can I, can I get in there again? Don't oh, budge. Okay, good. Uh, found a cigarette. That was scary. Okay. Let's go up here. Whoop. Oh, we got some, uh, japanese in here. Hey, um, What's up? Welcome to Bill Muhammad's Iron Tiger Karate Center. Would you like to learn my Iron Tiger technique? Won't be easy. Sure. First, a test. See that cliff over there? That? You must fall off of it. Until you think I've proved your worth. Speak to me when you think you're proving yourself. Um, hold on, let me check my phone. Sorry about that. Um... There we go. Alright, anyway, so we just gotta fall down this cliff? There's blood on this, though. Is this just gonna... What the hell? What the that? Meh, not impressed yet. Keep going! Okay. 
<laughs> okay. Alright. It's gonna keep doing this to me, isn't it? Huh. Mm-hmm. Alright. How long is this gonna last? Not impressed yet. Keep going. Sure. Who's dead? Who's taking damage anyway? It's me, right? Wait. Oh wait, all of us are taking damage. What the hell? Um Is this just gonna keep going? How about uh No wait. Let me see. Equipment. Oh I got a revolver for this guy. That's pretty cool. Can I examine this sign? Door jewel. Well, what would happen if I just keep falling down here? I probably I probably just look stupid right now, just falling off repeatedly. What in Jesus? The hell am I doing with my life? How long is this going to last? I don't know. Okay, you know what? I'm leaving. I don't have time for this shit. Do I? Nah, no. Not worth it. Okay, you know what? Let's actually give it a try. Fuck it. Well, this is a practice of insanity right here. How long do we have to keep doing this? I do not know. God damn. You just laughing there, my boy? Uh huh. This is probably just a pointless venture. Most likely. Those are very nice kanji letters though. Nope. <laughs> are you impressed yet? Well done! Oh, there we go! Nice! You proving your power. You got a karate scroll. Make sure you read it. Sure! Um, items? Hey, I got a cigarette. I didn't know that. Muhammad style scroll. It's written in English. It can't be that authentic. Increases defense. Give it to Brad. Wait, what? Okay. You got any more to say? Okay, cool. See? That wasn't so bad. Sometimes you just gotta fall off a cliff repeatedly just to prove yourself worthy of something. So I'm, I'm assuming there's nothing else back here. Alright, sorry about that, guys. I think we should, uh. Shit. Alright, um. Yeah, I think we should get some soup. To. Give us on a Brad. An empty bottle. Oh, wait, I can get more soup back to that guy. We can just heal or something. Go back here. Oh. We weren't there before. We got the joy. And so do you. Okay. Alright. Just gonna go down here then. I wonder how many save slots I got. Oh, I got a lot. Okay. Take that. Hey, Deglet, can I take more of your sweet-ass soup? I want some more of that shit. 
Yes, please. Um, hmm. Items. Soup to this guy. Honestly, I'm happier now. That oh, yeah, I said that. You said that. Uh, hmm. Bottle of soup. Items. Well, I'm not sure what the cigarette does, actually. Let me see that. Flavor so smooth, heals poison. Huh. This ad sponsored by Marlo Cigarettes. That an actual cigarette? Okay. Alright. Is there anything back here? Uh, let me open my door. Right. So nothing too flash nothing else too flashy has happened so far. Alright. Well my little sister's back. I guess I'm just straightforward recording this. Hello, chum. You don't have enough paper. Oh, yeah. So, in this world, women are extinct. Pretty much extinct. Well, nearing extin extinction. And my little buddy is the only female left. Who gave birth to buddy? I don't know. Maybe it was the girl in the, men in the menu screen. Maybe? Um. Hey, um. Still looking to get trash, brother. Bought a potato liquid. Help an old man out. I don't got any more though. Wait, did a bar change? Oh yeah, the Yeah, I got that because I got hit by a truck. There's nothing here though. Well, at least all my party members are still here. I don't know how good that is. Did I check in inside here? Oh, radio. No? Oh, um... Oh. You deal with it. What? Is that my... Is that... Is that my buddy? What? Is it? Okay. Am I... Am I good? Alright, I'm still good. I thought for sure I had more health. Maybe that's what the red thing is for? Because there was some flashing red thing. Uh, there was some. The screen was flashing red a while ago. Maybe he needs to take a, some sort of dosage or something. Oh, those are ways down. God damn it. Okay. Um, hmm. Um, equipment. Change. Is this better? Yeah, that's better. And their, um, their currency here is, we call this, is porn magazines. Because everyone is, all the men here are perverts. Well, I mean, to be fair, who el who in the world is not a pervert? So this is a way down, right? No? No? This way? No? Ah, I thought for sure that was a way down. God damn it. Can I check here? I thought the... It isn't, yeah, it's nearing extension because there are no more females. I would think so. <laughs> Do, have you seen this place? <laughs> Potato liquor. Oh, I can afford it. Cool. Alright, we can go back now. I'm not a big fan of fetch quests, but okay. If we needed to progress in this game, sure. Oh no, not this one. Pretty desolate. I just saw a guy riding a reindeer just a while ago. Oh. Right on, brother. Here goes. Here are those greasy pages. Yeah, and potato liquor. You got 50 magazines. Cool. Now I can buy more stuff. There's the investment guy here. There we go. Hello, chum. Can I invest my wonderful product? It's my really worth your time. Sure. Wonderful. 
Got the trust for suckers manual. Okay. What's that? Okay, any more dialogue? Pleasure doing business. Where is it? Trust for suckers? A manual on trust. What? Trust for suckers. You're an idiot. The end. Wow. Wow. Okay. Okay, game. Fuck you too. Oh, wow. okay. Well, I should have assumed so. Is that her picture? Mm, yeah, that's her picture. She's everywhere. And they called her ugly. How dare they? They called a the little buddy ugly. Okay, I don't think there's anything else out here. Whoa, what the fuck is that? That wasn't there before. Um. Maybe later. Maybe later. What the hell is happening? Why? You, um, doing okay there? Oh. Oh. 